Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of excited. Who doesn't want to go to Prague? Yeah, we'll make a day trip of it. Why not? Hello, my darling Fumi Nation. How are you? <laughs> How are we? My name is Fumi Desaluvold. For those of you that are stopping by for the very first time, you are so very welcome indeed. Are we living and loving, my darlings? I bought this at a thrift store. Yes. <laughs> I bought this dress at a thrift store and I ripped out all of the lining because it was not my complexion. Why would I have something lighter when I am darker? This is the point of me having my brand. Yes, 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 yes. So I have a brown slip. Let me just show you underneath. There you go. Chocolate, voila. And I just thought, why not? The weather is so gorgeous and I'm living and I am loving. Everything is coming, my darlings, sooner than later. Talking about sooner than later. We are having a meet and greet, my darlings, on the 21st of April. The tickets are below this episode. The tickets are pinned in the comment section. The tickets are on my Instagram page. They're on my TikTok. They're on my Twitter. It will always be pinned so that you guys can see it. It's going to be a phenomenal, epic sit down at a table soiree, darlings. Yes, I switched it up. I thought, you know what? You girls deserve it. If you do not get your tickets now, darling, and I hit capacity, there is nothing that I can do, sunshine. Juvia's Place is going to be out there living and loving with their support thank you so very much Juvia's I collabed with them twice not once but twice and they are out here forever supporting they supported us last year and they are out here again supporting us we have wardrobe of beauty darling when I tell you the brows wait for the punchline all of the skin tags off they are coming and they are sponsoring. We have the Laser Premier Skin Clinic. They are coming out here and they are doing their thing, honey. When I tell you, it's going to be so fabulous for lasers, for skin treatments, especially for women of color. We also have Color Dream. Thank you so very much. Their palettes are unmatched as far as I am concerned. We have Healthy Hair Studio. <laughs> you don't even know what they have for you. <laughs> you don't even know what they have for you we have doctors coming out here and we are talking about fertility we are talking about menopause we are talking about women's health we are talking about fitness we have q a we have giveaways we have dancing we have cake all at the novotel hotel another sponsor of which i love and cherish and i am so 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 very grateful for i cannot wait for you guys to enjoy that day the 21st of april get your tickets and when I tell you, oh my God, because after that, we head to New York. Guys, do not worry. Let me just finish with all of this and we're going to set up dates for New York. You're a bigger, huger crowd. You're a bigger what? You're a bigger, huger crowd. I keep on saying it. I became an American citizen in New York. When they tell me, for me, where are you from? I'm like, I'm from New York City, baby. <laughs> You're a bigger crowd. It's going to be much more for you guys. When I tell you that I've got stuff out for you guys, you don't even know. So don't worry. I see all of your questions and I want to tell you just as we have gotten the dates for London you're going to have the dates for New York I am coming, I'm coming, I'm coming I'm coming, let's get to the business at hand we have the beautiful conjoined twins, 34 year old Abby and Brittany the marriage of one of a pair of famous conjoined twins has promoted worldwide reaction and there's one question that just keeps popping up Abby and Brittany Hansel, 34, have been living private lives since their eight-episode show, Abby and Brittany, aired on TLC in 2012. But they were thrust back into the spotlight over the weekend when marriage records made public by the Today Show revealed fresh details. Abby, the left-side conjoined twin, married Josh Bowling, a nurse and United States Army veteran, in 2021. Oh, my God, that's three, four years ago. They live in Minnesota where the Hansel twins were born and raised, the New York Post reports. After it was revealed Abby had tied the knot, everybody began to ask questions, how does this work legally? One Reddit user took to social media forum to ask, so like legally, could they both get married to different people? Many commentators began to speculate on the answer with social media, declaring, yes, Abby and Brittany are legally two different people. In practice, it's a little more confusing. This is probably more like 
they are all married but legally only one of them can be married to the one dude you know because polygamy is illegal uh, one Reddit user weighed in suggesting one of the twins will be the legal spouse as far as the state is concerned. So it is theoretically possible that the other twin could someday decide to marry a different person. But given the way they have had to harmonize their entire lives, I imagine they would find it easier to stick to being married to just one person. The twins were also a target of trolls after the marriage broke but relatively private abby has since taken social media to hit back she posted an instagram video with a series of images on a loop and it had a voice over that said this message is to all the haters out there if you don't like what i do but you watch everything i'm doing then you're still a fan Girlfriend, I agree. Abby and Josh kept their marriage under wraps from the public eye until 2023 when they shared photos of their wedding ceremony on TikTok. Um, wedding guest resurfaced clip has now revealed an intimate moment from the lovebirds wedding on Facebook. In a 20 second video posted on Heidi Bowling's account, the couple are seen dancing and kissing at the reception. Abby and her sister wore all white sleeves. Hold on. Yes, my darling. Gown and a lace back dress while Bowling wore a grey suit. Bowling is seen staring into his blushing bride's eyes while Britney supports her sister. The duo originally appeared on the Oprah Winfrey show in 1996 explaining their lives as conjoined twins. They were born as Desphalios conjoined twins, a rare condition when two heads are on a single body with one genital system, two, three or four arms, two hearts and two legs. The Henson twins share a bloodstream and all organs below the waist. Abby controls the right arm and leg while Brittany controls the left side. God bless them. God bless them. I don't, I have no respect for the horrible, tasteless trolls. What a horrible, tasteless thing to say and do, really and truly. They've lived their whole lives together and they have shared everything together. And I'm under the impression that they've also been able to mentally click off. You know, sometimes when you're with your friend or whatever, hobby or whatever, you can just mentally click off. I'm sure they can do that. It might be very, very, very strange to us, but it's not strange to them. I don't even think it's strange. I don't. What are their options? Because if you have any, let me know. What are their options? They've lived their entire lives like this and they're trying to find normalcy in a life that is completely different for everybody else. I think it would be much more appropriate to say congratulations. And I know what you're saying, they're obvious. But what I'm saying is that that does not apply to them because they are different. They have a completely different life of which they have managed to see to fruition and come into their adulthood and do all kinds of wonderful things of which you and I cannot even begin to understand. That's mental power. And I think she was hurt and she's justified that we did not even give her the grace to say congratulations. Her sister will support her. It could have been any or the other. Forget about the gruesome. And that's the thing I want to talk about when it comes to relationships. Everybody's thinking below the waist. If you think that's what makes a relationship, then this is why there are so many relationships that are not working. Because it's more than that. It is companionship. It's love. It's respect. It's affection. And they've got that. So shame on the trolls for trolling them like that. That was not necessary at all. You have to be mature. You have to be mature and say to yourself, you know what, thank the Lord Jesus, amen. And there are some of you out here that can't even get married. At least they got married with the sister in two.
to me, it's not a case of, is it normal? Is it this? Is it that? It's very rude, actually. They should be upheld and say, good job. You know what? If you like it, I love it. I really and truly. If they like it, I love it. Support. Most especially when they've got, they've, they're living a very unique life. And it has to be upheld with the utmost respect. That's how I look at it. Um, in other news, we have memberships only. And we're kicking it with our fitness. Some of you might be saying, where do I sign up? It is right here where it says join. You will see where it says Fumi's Fitness every day. That's where you join. I'm there every day, kicking it with you guys. We're working out. We're doing our thing. And I leave it uploaded there for you guys. And only members can watch it. And you can watch it repeatedly. Because we are, oh, we are three quarters of a million. There's no way that we can get one exact time. So the way I've done it is that it's there every day. Anybody that comes on live, I'll let you know. Usually for me, if you want to know, I would be there in the mornings, 10 in the morning, 6 p.m. in the evening. I'll let you guys have a notification and say, I'm coming on live in a hot, hot minute. Come on and join me. Maybe I'll do that. But I will not delete the video so you don't miss anything. And it's only members that will be exclusive to this. And it's to the fitness and it is everything else behind the scenes. But let us start with the fitness because you guys really want the shoulders. And I will show you because I live and I love my weights. When I work out, I'm able to clear my head. I become very clear headed and I'm able to um, think. And ideas pop up in my head of which I just jump and drop it on my phone. So please do not forget to like, to subscribe, hit the notification button, my darlings. And I will see you what? I'll see you sooner than later. All of my love. Mwah.